Today we'll be talking about the CADTH Common Drug Review, Canada's therapeutic drug review process. This video is brought to you by the Northern BC iGEM team. Today we're going to be talking about the CADTH, which is the Canadian Agency for Drugs and Technologies in Health. This is a not-for-profit organization that oversees the decision-making process of the implementation and optimal use of drugs and medical devices in the Canadian healthcare system. One part of the CADTH is the Common Drug Review, referred to as the CDR. This is the process that most drugs go through before entering the public system. This process involves many steps, starting off with a submission from a manufacturer. This submission is received and processed by the CDR, which, is, which then conducts a systematic review based on the available clinical evidence provided by the manufacturer. The CDR also completes an independent literature review to look into the data provided by the manufacturer. After this, the CDR prepares a clinical pharmacoeconomic review report, which is then passed off to the Canadian Drug Expert Committee, also called the CDEC. The CDEC is a separate committee that is in charge of making the recommendations for the drugs that are reviewed through the CDR process. These recommendations can relate to strategies for optimal drug use and the public funding the drug might receive. It is composed of 14 members and one chair. Two of these members are public members, providing more perspective for the committee. The committee overall is composed of experts in the field such as pharmaceutics, economics, drug therapy, and drug utilization. The CDC committee will deliberate over the available evidence on the drug, specifically looking into topics such as patient group input, clinical studies, compared alternatives, therapeutic advantages, and one of the big ones, cost and cost effectiveness. After deliberation, the CDEC will make its final recommendation of whether or not the drug should fall under public funding. However, this is only a recommendation. Each drug plan gets to make its own decision on how they will list the drug based on the CDEC final recommendation. In summary, the review process consists of the manufacturer submission, the CDR processing, the CDEC review, and their final recommendation. The goal of this process is to decide whether or not a drug should fall under public funding. However, the CDEC final recommendation for this is non-binding, meaning each drug plan still gets to make its own decision on how the drug will be listed. Thanks for watching. For any more information, you can visit www.cadth.ca or there'll be links available in the description.